study of your scope here's my body broken like a bloody joke and oh what jokes we make wobble shit and shake cut and paste like angelina do undo genealogy has no hold on you this bridge you lean on spanning this body of troubled water this mass of someone's daughter planning do undo when I'm conscious, there's no body. Sometimes I'm just an ear, spread like a fugue across a score, and then a knot, constricted, full of war, a hard throat pushing against the world. Sometimes I'm all lines, a bundle of skin stretched over acupuncture scars. Sometimes I'm landmines. Sometimes I'm thighs. Sometimes I'm abdomen, a well to fill. I won't, maybe I will. Oh, yes, Thank you, Sophie. <laughs> 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 this is a, <clears throat> a brief lesson in the pursuit of freedom and avoidance of colonialism with admonishments and advice, etc. <laughs> when those mighty men like Columbus went out over sea to find new things, <laughs> all round about, off they sailed from the isle, and it took them a while, but at last they found land, yet could not understand how the creatures they met looked like humans, and yet they were not very dressed. No, not even wearing a vest. And their skin was not white. No, not even quite. It was dark. It was brown. Eyes under a frown, staring like night in a storm, giving a fright to Columbus et al. Like nothing they'd ever seen born. Like nothing they'd ever seen born. They did not have tails, these males and females. No fur on the skin, all beards on the chin, two eyes, one nose, ten fingers, ten toes. Incredibly, one must suppose they were human-ish at that. And yet not one of them wore a hat. No! Not one of them wore a hat. These creatures sang songs and they gathered in throngs, they danced to the beat of a drum. Oh. 